Good evening. I'm joined once again by Hamilton resident Sheena Marie Snively. I was alerted to the fact that you might be a witch. Well, I was, you know, a little bit of a troubled teen, 15 years old. I had these three friends, Crystal, Sam, and Buffy. And you know, we that, that movie The Craft just came out. And you know, we all thought that we were witches. It was like the twilight of that day. As soon as that lunch bell rang, we were gone. We were out of there, you know? And we'd always go back to my place because my parents both worked, so they weren't home. Perfect. So, you know, we thought we were all witches and we would like go back and we'd like cast love spells on other boys and things. Were you like, sexually active at this point? Maybe a little bit. Really? Yeah. With one boy so, or many boys? Well, there was this one guy and he had a really big head and I would call him Big Head. How far did you go with this Big Head? A couple BJs. You said it was Buffy, Crystal. Buffy, Crystal, and Sam. And the other thing too is Buffy also thought that she was a vampire. So that's Buffy. Crystal. Crystal. Crystal was a piece of work. Maybe we shouldn't use that because this poor girl is going to see that. We'll change her name. What do you want to call her now? Sophia. Sophia. <laughs> Sophia's Crystal, mm -hmm. who were hiding her identity. Right. And Sam. Buffy's Buffy. Right. And then Sam. And Sam. Sam was really sweet. The four of you are around the Ouija board. Earth. Air. Fire. Water. So. We, we all had we all had this like our own colored wax poured into like a special vase thing. So we, jars, not a vase. Yeah, it was like a, like a mason jar. You know, a jar, like jam you put, jar. Yeah, you put jam in it. Yeah, not with a like vase. a silver top, like yeah. a homemade jam a jar. jar. Yeah. No vase. It was supposed to be like a special scepter thing of special you know. jar. Yeah. Right. So we all pour the stuff in there, and all of a sudden. It starts boiling, rumbling, rumbling, shaking, and all of a sudden, all the liquid comes out of the jar like this, and then it just goes BOOM! And it like explodes all over the place. How did this happen? I am 110% positive that we invoked something that day. Had you been using drugs at the time? I don't, I, maybe that day, a little, but not, you know, nothing. Nothing was, crazy. No, nothing. no. Nothing would make this you. This was magic. Right. It was magic. How has this changed your life? That was a turning point for Sheena Snively. In, wh in which direction? You know, to be a better person. I feel like this. Maybe, maybe the spirit of man always living with me. You know. To make you a better person. To make me a better person. To make me a role model for other people. And just walk me through the timeline. Did you burn down the barn before or after the wax incident? Oh, the barn burning was after. Okay. So it was just... positive that you burnt down a barn and almost, and almost yeah. killed horses and had to go to boarding school. Yes, that was a positive moment. positive moment, moment that you burned down someone's property. Right, because those moments in this timeline of this life that is Sheena Snively, this timeline has brought me to here. Bad so. person, bad person, bad person. Manon, good, good. Burned down a barn, good. Good, 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 good. Thank you for joining me today. Oh, you're welcome. No, thanks.